mindset Free your mind, free your mind Mindset, free your mind I just start, let them know, let them know, let them know Oh, words from the wise I just start, he will never lie Stand tall, he will never die Will forever shine I just start, shine like the star in the sky Some hate, some love Blessed love, pleasant, good afternoon Warm welcome mindset program I just start, I'm your host one for greet the item in the divine name of his imperial majesty, Emperor Il Selassie the first, Empress Men in the first, one more day above ground, and we give him thanks and praise for life, health and strength, beautiful viewers and subscribers. So what we are look upon in the day, we are look upon um, Freddie McGregor and Burning Spear, yes I. That we are look upon. So, we could look upon burning spear. Burning spear um, decides, say, you know, he's gonna give back because as a youth growing up, um, going to school, you know, much school never really have certain facilities. So, he'll be giving back to a school in his um, hometown. And um, we also look upon Freddie McGregor, which is. Um, you know, a congratulate soldier and their Grammy Award win. Yeah. As we know, um, Freddie was one of the bridging them who was an advocate in um that it you know the 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 the, the Grammy win too many times by um the Marlies. You know, cause, yeah, we hear that in the past and things. So, make we look upon um, make we look upon the spear, you know, burning spear and where burning spear, I deal with. You know what I mean? Yeah. So, going at the article, the article say, tomorrow the regular legend reach out to his former school by funding a pre-Easter. Tree there. It is um, coordinated by Martina Zena Samuel, who conducts several charity events for the 77 year old artist, which, with the help of Zona, I got involved in even more in giving back because I listened to what he says when I was a young. Man, nobody give us anything. So a treat like this can make the kids smile and have a nice time, said Burning Spear. Funded by the Anglican Church in the 1890s, St. Anne's Bay Infant School moved to its current site in the 1920, Burning Spear, who lived in New York, has not been to Jamaica for more than five years, but kept in tune with development in the country through family, friends, and social media. Yes, yeah, so he was born Winston Rodney, the second last of 14 children for General Rodney, Gerald Rodney, a farmer from St. Catherine and his wife, Edna, who was born in St. Saint, Saint Bay. Life in coastal town was a joy for preteen Rodney and his sibling. I love swimming. Things like that I was involved in as a youth in the youth club and remember having a lot of fun a lot of funds used to enjoy myself, he recall. St. Anne's Bay was also the hometown of Marcus Gavi, the Pan African hero who inspired Burning Spear greatest work. Marcus Gavi 
his seminal album was released in 1975. Recently, Spear Management announced that the double Grammy winning artist will return to the stage after a decade long absent. He is scheduled to perform at um, Rotterdam in Spain in August and welcome to Jamra Cruise in December. Zane and some of them information there we um, heard previously. And it's a good thing to, you know I mean, to give back to your community and to, you know, even the school that you used to go, that is a, that is a great thing, you know what I mean? And as Rasta, I did a reading with a virgin the other day and him, him did a talk about Ailey Selassie School in Kingston that, um, you know, nobody, as Rasta, not really um, I do nothing towards developing the school and, you know what I mean, helping out the school. And I don't know how true that is, Zane, but I, I, I can't say the bridging would be, you know, just making things up and throwing things out there like that. You know what I mean? There have to be some, um, something like that. You know what I mean? Them say if it not go so it go near so. But it's always a good thing, you know what I mean, to give back to your community and what Spear is doing there is um, you know, quite quite um quite a good thing. You know, so you know, yeah, we, we, we commend Spear upon that because Spear is a legend, you know, in a the in a the thing. Yeah. Legend, regardless of some of the some recent things we might we might see, you see me I say, but um the money a legend, you know I've had the honor to um to watch the money perform live probably about three times in my lifetime, you know what I mean, so great great artist great 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 artist and you know Burning Spear you know we have so much a Burning Spear album. But you remember, you know, back in the days we had about um we had about two Burning Spear album. One I'm first first album and then um the Marcus Ghost Zane are seminal. Well I think him him get grammar for that album. You see it, so yeah man, Burning Spear give thanks him been off the road for a little while now and him set for return. Um, you know, the summer scene. So, yeah, man, once we look out for that because the man is a real musician and, you know, performer. Yeah, man, seriously. Yeah, man, when the money work, the money work. You see me, I say? Yeah, man, money work, them work. So, right there, so there with, um, with Burning Spear right now, Zin, we... We're going to look upon Freddie McGregor. As you say, um, Freddie, Freddie, I congratulate uh, Soldier and the Grammy Award. Freddie said, boy, are the best um, reggae album. And I think him, him, him but anyway, we are going to go in it because him said, um, it was the only reggae album Zin, that win that win the Grammy. You understand? Yeah, it was the only reggae album that win the Grammy. So McGregor, who has been nominated once for Best Reggae Album, told the Jamaica Observer that that Soldier and other American bands follow the part of reggae artists from the 70s and 80s by touring non-stop to build their, their brand. That workload paid off on April 3rd at the Grammy in Los Angeles when their album Beauty in Silence topped top five Jamaican rival include previous winner 
Sean Paul and Gramps Morgan. These are dire time for contemporary reggae. McGregor believe the Billboard reggae chart is gone. The the reggae Grammy sort slot might as well go to course. Jamaican artists, radio personnel, and selectors do not like reggae anymore. So, what's the point? He asks. Give the reggae Grammy to those who love reggae and who play reggae. There have been rumors that Billboard magazine is contemplating dropping its weekly reggae table and installing an Afrobeat chart in an interview with The Observer recently. An insider from the duplication the duplication denied this. Outsiders from the duplication or publication, I beg your pardon, talk about duplication. American band like soldiers stick figure the green and re rebellion have dominated the billboard reggae chart in recent years. Their song are inspired by the roots reggae message and sound many fans in the United States and Europe, Europe identify with as Jamaican music. Jamaican artists and producers have lost the appetite for that flavor. McGregor noted, reggae was created to spread jalov around the world. The other one, dancehall, is about violence, crime, nakedness, liquor. I won't say too much. Who in the current Jamaican music farm doing well except coffee? Well, all, have, all eyes have to see to let, this, let we decide. Jamaican music is doing better now than when we gave it to them? Or is it worse now? And where will it go from here? He said, Beauty in the Silent made Soja the second non-Jamaican act to win the best reggae album Grammy. British band Steel Pulse was the first with Babylon the bandit in 1987. The Isle Tour, the Isle Taught Live and Living by Sean Paul, Gramps Morgan, Positive Vibration, 10 by, 10 by Spice, Pumja, It by Itana, and Royal by Jesse Royal complete the 2022 20, best reggae album feel. And that is what. Um, Freddie McGregor is saying that um, the best and the only reggae album win the Grammy this year. I don't know how the item see because um, Gramps Mag and them do reggae. See, and I'm sure that was probably a, a reggae album that he put out. Um, Jesse Royal do reggae. I'm sure that probably was. Uh, you know what I mean? A, 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 a reggae album. Also, Itana do reggae. And I'm sure that probably was a reggae album also. You know what I mean? So, I don't know where the big ship I say. Um, when he said it's the best reggae album win. I, you know, well, probably because, you know, a them win. You know? But you know the uproar been um them take over music and all of them something there from the other day still. I don't know if them can really take away the music. I think them can try to take away the music, but oh oh you go oh you go really do that. Unless you 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 are dictating how certain things go, you are you know controlling the market and all of them things there. 
That is the way probably them can um, control it. You see, they probably could control it to an extent, but I don't think them can take it away and say, boy, I feed them on. You understand? No matter where you do. Yeah, probably a hundred years from now, if you don't protect it properly, you know, they could write that um, a them originated and all of these things. They could do that. You understand? But a hundred years from now, I honestly can't see them really do that because things will change so significantly. And it's not going to be on the same and that we see it on today. Zane, rest assured. Rest assured. You alright? Yeah, man, rest assured it's not going to be the same. But it makes some interesting um, points. Because he talk about the one, the, the other one. Zane, which is dancer is about violence, crime, nakedness, liquor, and, you know what I mean, all sorts of other things, which is, is, is right. You know, that is what dance mostly project. Now, other dance artists, two dance artists was uh, among the, um, the nominees. You know what I mean? Sean Paul and, and Spice. Yeah, Sean Paul and Spice. And we see them them artists they do a lot of numbers. And I don't know if 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 uh, I see Spice do a lot of shows, but I don't know if they would probably um take them shows that into consideration because they're not tours. And they're not like some official type of show where a, 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 a them type of people there are put on certain events and you know what I mean? And then again we hear somebody as a boy um pad up front pad up front music can can win dance I don't I don't know what they mean by that. You know, pad up front music. I, I, you know, the people are terrible. <laughs> people have said pad up front music dance all can't win can't win reggae can't win Grammy people are troublesome bad pad up front I wonder what them attack when them say pad up front dance all can't win <laughs> don't know star I don't know I don't I don't know but it look away, you know, it look away still. It look away still, I say, I know. So I don't know if, you know, if she could have really win the reggae still, the, you know, because then again, I know reggae she had up on the level there. And them group, Grammy, see, them Grammy group, reggae and dance all in the same category. That is how them see it because, you know what I mean? I, I don't think them more um have too much people that win this thing because if you have a have a, a reggae category zine and you have all other different category, I guess they don't they do not see dance as a different genre from reggae. They see reggae and dance as the same thing because I think probably it's Jamaicans that, you know, do the same music and um, dance all birth from out of reggae. So I think they're just saying, you know, them them uh, them two music here are the, are the said music them. You understand? Are the said music. One one of one of them does uh attack faster and it more graphical. And the other one is more calm, collective, and you know what I mean, more positive, uplifting, inspirational um, lyrics. You know that is going to influence people 
in a in a the in a the right way. You see it? So two different things. Many of us see them see it as, but you know, other people like them people who run this academy, them see reggae and dance hall as one thing. You see me I say, reggae are reggae and dance hall is a place when you know what I mean reggae a play or any other music I play, you 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 know that venue and a dance. It's it's a, it's called a dance hall. You know? <laughs> yeah, so let me know your views, your thoughts, mindset family, manners and respect. Leave your comment in the comment section. And you know what I mean? We'll see the item pan pan the rebound. All right, manners and respect, peace and love. Ja Rastafari. Subscribe button. See you on the next video. I just got the mindset.